Tell us about your baskets. Um, this is a bow flat basket and a barrel or a vessel. What do we call it? Vessel? <laughs> a vessel. A vessel. It's an old design from a um, classic Navajo rug or, oh, or yeah. a blanket. Well, back before I was beginning to weave, um, my mother-in-law, she put a, a corn pellet on my hair, my hand. Um, first she did is put some corn pellet on the spider web, and then she prayed and sing some song and then put it on my hand. That's, I Good. guess that's why I got be a good weaver. Such a good weaver with yeah. the corn pollen and uh -huh. the spider web? Yeah, on my hand. She blessed. How, how old were you? Around about 25, 25 years old. Really? Mm -hmm. And then after that you started weaving yeah. rugs or baskets? Baskets. Since then I've been weaving baskets. It was your mother-in-law or your Mother-in-law. My mother-in-law. Before I was a rug weaver when I haven't get married yet. And then after I got married, that's when I do baskets, start weaving. Because my in-laws, they were basket weavers, Mary, Sally Black, they were basket weavers. Who and was your mother-in-law? Betty Holiday. Betty Holiday. Uh -huh. And she was married to Teddy? Teddy Holiday, yeah. And Teddy was a medicine man. Yeah. And was she a medicine woman? Yeah, she is. And do you know, is that a traditional ceremony to do with weavers? To make them weave better? Um, not really. So she's the only one that knows. Um, I, she never, she doesn't, she never did it to anybody, only me. Mm. So I don't know if she did it to Mary, mm -hmm. if that's her daughter, Mary Black. I don't, she never told me she did that, but. Did, did she, you, did you feel that that helped you learn to I, weave better? I, yeah, that helped me a lot. So do you like weaving um, any particular shape better than the other shape? Um, I like, the best I like is the flat one. The flat? Uh-huh, but time to time I like to do barrel too. Is it? I, it's fun. Is it hard to keep the shape of yeah, the barrel? Yeah, it is, uh-huh. How, how do you do that? How do you make it uh, consistent and, and, and make sure that the design is properly placed? Nothing. I just weave. I don't know. It just comes out like that. It's all up here? Uh-huh. It's all up here, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you? And my hand. Was your mother a basket weaver? No, but my dad was. Your dad was? Mm -hmm. Is he still? No. That's a long time ago. He used to weave. I remember when I was a kid, he used to make um, traditional baskets. Mm -hmm. Was that before he became a medicine man? Yeah. And then once he became a medicine man, he stopped making them? Mm -hmm. What do you find most satisfying about weaving the baskets? What is it that you like the most? The... Being able the, the, to pay for your chitty. That's one thing. <laughs> <laughs> and I like to do difficult design that gives me challenge. Uh -huh. Challenging. And... I don't know, I just love doing it, putting the colors together. How do you know what colors go well together? Mm, you just know? It's I just, just still it, everything's just up here, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I look at pattern, pictures, and that's how I look get at, my colors together. Look at the landscape? Yeah, landscape too. Okay. What else do you want to tell people about your baskets? I, I don't know. I just love weaving and I love money. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs>